I'm Peter Block here at ACC 2019 in New Orleans. On my left is Otavio Berlanger from Brazil. And Otavio has been working with Ticagrelor versus Clopidogrel, the TREAT trial, an interesting trial, which uh, at, at front end you say, oh, yeah, doesn't show very much difference, no big deal. But there's a lot of information in this trial, Otavio, and some signals which may become important. This is an underpowered trial to begin with. Uh, so what do we learn from TREAT? Well, I think we learned a couple of lessons. So first of all, thanks very much, Peter, for the invitation. It's a pleasure to be here. So TREAT was a trial designed primarily to assess safety. So uh, as you remember, last year here at ACC, we presented a primary endpoint, which was TIMI major bleeding at 30 days, and we assessed whether Ticagrelor was not inferior to clopidogrel with regards to major bleeding, and that was the case. So um, it, it seems to, to be safe to start Ticagrelor with or after thrombolytic therapy in terms of major bleeding and also fatal bleeding or intracranial bleeding. And the bleeding events that really matter. But of course, we had a pre-specified analysis at 12 months, and when we're interpreting a trial, it's important to have the complete picture. So here at ACC, we're presenting the 12-month results, both in terms of safety and also in terms of efficacy. So, okay, now let me interrupt, because sure. you didn't say this is STEMI patients who are treated with thrombolytics. Now, in the United States, we don't see a lot of those patients, yeah. but in, in Brazil you do, in China you do, Russia you do, Canada still has a number of those patients. So uh, it, in the world population, there's still a lot of lytics being given to patients with STEMI, correct? Yes, that's absolutely correct. And, and in this trial, we try to reflect that. But the countries you just mentioned participated, other countries in Eastern Europe too and Latin America. So it still depend on the country, 30, 40 to 50% yeah. of patients are still manage it with lytics, at least as the initial reperfusion okay. strategy. So afterwards, Ticagrelor versus Clopidogrel, what'd you find? So we found in terms of safety, uh, results went in the same direction, so no difference at 12 months in terms of major bleeding rates, intracranial bleeding rates, and also fatal bleeding rates. So it seems that a safety signal is maintained at 12 months. Of course, we needed also to access efficacy. Uh, of, as, as you correctly alluded to, uh, this is another power try to access efficacy. Nevertheless, we've seen a 12% relative risk reduction of major cardiovascular events. This is an event of cardiovascular death, stroke, and mind. With Ticagrelor. With Ticagrelor, TIA. But of course, the, the, uh, these results were not statistically significant because it's this is a trial, it's a moderate size of trial, it's 3,799 yeah. patients, 3,800 patients. And we will need like 15,000 uh, 15, yeah. patients. Or, so in short uh, version, it's underpowered. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so one, 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 one way to, but Whenever you have a, a neutral results in terms of efficacy, I think it's very important to understand whether it's a definitive neutral result or it's a hypothesis generating neutral, resu in neutral result. In other words, does the confidence interval exclude the possibility of a benefit? And, and the confidence interval of our effect estimates, I mean, the, the effects seen in Plato are contained in that. And we also are presenting a pool analysis between Plato and TREAT. And when we pull the two studies together, both the Plato overall population and the Plato STEMI population, you see a reduction of major cardiovascular events with zero inconsistency between trials. So Ticagrelor is not out of the picture as far as you're concerned. Uh, definitely and, not. And uh, we may see a further study to see whether or not this really makes a difference. But the signals are there, so let's not throw Ticagrelor out quite yet. Of course. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you.